Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to LA Noir for more crime fighting point and click action. We are right back where we left off, at the Wilshire Police Station. We're about to go and see why we've been called in. Um, if you haven't already done so, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell down below the video. So you get a notification to your device every time I upload. And as always guys, thank you all for your ongoing support. Any messages for me, Hopkins? Remember the usual warning, guys. This episode could contain scenes which some viewers find upsetting or distressing. Pinker wants you in tech services. Maybe you'll be more popular downstairs. Thank you for the help. Not. Guess we're going downstairs to talk to Pinker. Is he in here? Hey, Cole. You're not winning any popularity contests upstairs, you know. You can say that again. What have you got for me? Uh, where do you go. stand? I think you're a good cop, but I try and stay out of politics. Everybody Wise. stay out of politics, Ray. Well, don't quote <laughs> me, but I'm hoping that Parker will get the job and clean this place up. I have your photographs. Oh, yeah? You can use the what photographs are these? There's quite a lot of detail. Oh, from the earrings, maybe? Very funny. <laughs> You're right, right? We have our man. You take a nice photo. Nice. <laughs> I don't think there's uh, any need to inspect that one. Who's this? Bringing the watcher a match for our John Doe. He's obviously the competitive bid. Ah. Get this over to Lockheed so we can get a name for this guy. It's already it's the on the guy. Way. The one we found in the fridge. Okay. Who's Howard this? Hughes, That's Mapes. Industrialist, aviator, and playboy, and Vernon Mapes, ex-dirty cop, and business fixer. Hmm. I found a similar tie pin along with a dead guy in a fridge. Could well be the tie pin. Now, what else are we looking for here? What are we looking for here? It's a bit like coal from the side profile. We just got to zoom in on the tie pin or something. I don't know. It, I think we did it, didn't we? Don't know. <laughs> I guess we've done that one. What's this? Excellent photography. Tomiko. So if Tomiko had the goods on McClellan, too bad they blew the place to hell. Hmm. So I guess this, like the <coughs> experiment details, what's this one? Two guys. Is this McClellan? Can anyone make out the street number behind him? Are you kidding? With my eyesight? Uh, maybe we can. This is West something. Okay, let's try this one. Ah, three nine four one. Maybe we can figure out where that is. Cole, can you help me with a little experiment? Use the eyedropper in front of you. One drop from each of the bottles on the desk. Place the drops in the petri dish. Okay. If we have to. Hey, can you give me a Why do we have to do this? I got a hard case I need to break. One of each. Okay, and this one. Whoa! Could that be what caused the explosion? It's okay, guys. Just a little experiment. Can you guys knock it off? Everyone's still jumping <laughs> from that bang this morning. Very funny, Ray. He just took a couple of years off my life expectancy. <laughs> same trick to me about an hour ago. So that was the stuff that caused the explosion. I think so. Acetic anhydride is almost as explosive as nitro, and when mixed with perchloric acid, it's very unstable. It needs to be cooled. Interesting. We used linseed oil. You could add any organic compound to trigger an explosion. Three little ah. Yeah. And they were using a hundred-gallon vat. So that could be what 
what did it then? Is there anything else in here? What is this thing? What is this? McClellan's patent application. Oh. So we have McClellan raising a patent and selling to Hughes, and Akamato copying the details for Lockheed. Where does that leave Nicholson? Yeah. With a great big bowl. True. Right, what now? What now? I say we get over to the house and see what we can find. Then we see the DA for a warrant on Mates. Okay. Uh, how do we know what house it is? Don't we need to call it in or something? Well, or just ask at the desk or something, I guess? Or do we just know where it is? Apparently we just know where it is. 3941 West 2nd Street, apparently. See him? I don't know how we knew that, but the there we go. That case oh god, our car's all the way around the back. Okay, let's go and get in the car. Flipping hell, why did it get parked in here? Oh yeah, we went in that way, didn't we? <laughs> okay, come on, Biggs. I haven't got all day to wait for you, mate. We've got to go to the house. Come on, old man. Get in the car. There we go. Uh, can we go this way, actually? We can't. Can you believe that? I'll go out this way, then. Let's put the sirens on. Get there as quick as we can. So, the mystery deepens. It was those three chemicals together which caused the explosion. The question is, was it done on purpose? We don't know that yet, I guess, but I'm sure we'll figure that out. Could well have been purposely done. Maybe it wasn't. Oh, it's only around the corner. That's good. Very helpful for us. Let's turn the sirens off so they don't get spooked if anyone's here. House in the photograph. 11.46am. Is the door open? It is. That's not a good sign, is it? We could be walking into a gunfight here. Uh oh. Av gas, if I'm not mistaken. It's all around the floor. Uh oh. Was someone going to set this on fire? <coughs> Possibly. Is there another one? Yeah, there is, look. Damn. Okay. Anything on the table? No. Anything through here? No. On here, maybe? No. What's this? A ticket and a passport. Tourist ticket from Miami to Grand Bahama. Mm. Why leave your ticket behind? Yeah. Just cleaning up. Interesting. Trying to make it look like he left. We go ten. Yeah. It's Hangstrom's passport. It's a chemist. Hmm. There he is. And McClellan are the same man. Interesting. Whoa. The gas, call the gas. We gotta get out of here right now. How the hell are we gonna get out? By the stove. Shoot the gas line. Oh. Flip here now. Get out. Run. Oh, flip. How are we gonna get out of here? I can't see anything. Get out the window? Yeah, we can. Nice. <gasps> it's Mapes! I knew he was involved. Let's get after him. Whoa, he's gone really quickly. He's got a fast car. Let's get after him. Crap, he's gone. I missed the turning. Oh, wait, there he goes. That was convenient for us. Crap. Thank you. 
try not to hit everything. I'm trying, I'm trying. Right, shoot his tyres. This car's really fast. Whoa! Okay, no, he's swerving around a lot. I can't get near him. His car's too quick. Well, that was lucky. Ooh. Why is he going to Nicholson Electro plating? What's he doing? Whoa. Why is he driving that way? Shit. Use security men, Cole. Stay on mates. Oh Knock no. Off the road if you have to, but stay on that fucker. Okay. One track. We That wasn't too bad. Smash the son of a bitch's rear wheels. I'm, I can't even get near him, Biggs. Shut up. I can't get a target that isn't there, Bell. Biggs, for goodness sake, shut up. I'm wedged. I've got to catch him up. Look, there he is. Seems to be slowing down a little bit for some reason. We've also got some of these jokers behind us as well. Right, shoot his tyres. Come on. We can get him now. What the hell? The way that car's behaving is very weird. The other guys are gone, by the way, which is good news for us. Uh oh. Oh no, he's made it. Out of the frying pan. Oh crap. Where's he going? Oh no. Really? We're going to have to fight all. Like these military dudes? Feels a little bit unnecessary. Uh, there's quite a few of them, isn't there? Ooh, took my hat off. <laughs> Come on, stick your head out. I'll take you guys out. Stay in cover. Come on, pop your head up. You know you want to. Yeah, good idea, cover. Biggs. Why is that guy behind us? Oh, there's more of them. Yes, cops are incoming. Back up. Throw out the guns. The cavalry's arrived. Where are these other guys? Okay, can we take this gun? Cat, nice. Boom! Dead men are heavier, whatever that means. Got a trophy for doing something. Maybe it's a certain amount of enemies killed or something, I don't know. I hit him. I hit him again. He's down. Yeah, let's go and get him. We'll take this gun as well. I think this is like a a proper rifle thing. Right, let's go in and get this son of a gun. Boom! Oh, okay, we'll do it again. Boom! Whoa, there's a lot of guys in here. Find some cover. Okay. Get into cover. Did I see one in the plane? I did, look. I think we've got him. I'm not sure. Oh, we didn't. We did now. Thanks, mate. Okay. Got him. Nice. Where is this guy? Damn mapes. Let's take him down. Stay in cover. Up there, look. Boom. How is he still alive? Just by out of there. Run out of ammo on that gun, that's annoying. 
this one will have to do for now. Oh, headshot, I think. Come on, Phelps, move. Right, into cover. Jeez, there's a lot of guys here. Could do with this guy, like, popping his head up a bit. Yes, we got him. Okay, moving up, moving up. Go for the guy up high, Biggs. still alive there we go did we get him he's still alive are you kidding me how many bullets is this guy taking Ugh, I don't believe it finally down he goes jeez that guy was eating bullets is that mapes I think it might reload I think we got him we did nice we did it we took him down you're gonna have to explain this to me again so the guy at the chemical plant he's planning on selling his magic formula to another company and skipping town with his assistant but he blows himself up before he can manage it so why right. the dead body in the refrigerator Mapes, captain he was eliminating all competitors for the process. When it went bad, see. he burnt down the apartment to remove all connection between Hughes and the plant. Mapes, right. I remember Vernon Mapes. Yeah. The guy had good, honest cops hanging their heads in shame. Ah, really? Glad he's finally out of commission. So he was dodgy all along. Well, I feel better about taking him out now. Between the spruce goose and half the city exploding might just have made the case of the decade yay that'll do our reputation a little bit of good I suppose trophy earned the big unfriendly okay nook's an electro plane 16 out of 16 clues 6 out of 6 um, questions correct 5 stars again case notes McClellan and Okamoto might never be heard from again, but neither will Vernon Mapes. Nicely done. On to the next one. What's next? Good morning, Doctor. And a good morning to you oh. too, Elsa. You look radiant. Thank you, Doctor. We haven't been seeing much of you lately, Elsa. You've been missing appointments. I'm sorry, Doctor. I've been feeling much better. That's very good to hear. And what has brought about this improvement? It's Spending time, time with Cole. He's convinced me to fight my addiction. Ah, the policeman from the newspapers. How has he coped with his fall from grace? He can you would know all about that, wouldn't you? Rather than the ivory tower he created for himself. It's making him stronger. It's making me stronger, help You wouldn't make a bad analyst yourself, Elsa. Should we swap seats? <laughs> That is a really creepy smile. And what is that? In my case, you, you went through hell along with me and still came out smiling. In mm. Paul's case, his friend, that case. Kelso? You've heard of him? No, uh, I just like the sound of his name. Call You're a liar. On that case is Jack a Don't tell him that, he's no. involved. He I mean, she doesn't know that, but... but He's a special investigator. I thought you didn't know him. I have never met the gentleman in question. Hmm. Digging a bit. Are we place. digging in that hole? All things that might be linked to some fires he's investigating. You look pale, Doctor. It's cold in here, Elsa. I think I'll close the window. Uh oh. I'd get out of there if I were you. Why are you looking at me like that, Elsa? You arranged for Lou to work at Elysian Fields, Doctor. Your fears are unfair. Why is she, like, confronting him on it without Cole or Jack? I meet many people in 
Unless they sent her to do it, but that would be pretty dangerous. Yeah, you're dodgy. I'm sorry that you have come to that conclusion, Elsa. Uh oh, we saw what he did to Courtney. He's not going to smack her over the head with that, is he? Oh my days, he is. Uh oh. I can see your future, Elsa. Cole, the policeman, and Jack, the investigator. It's an unfortunate and grisly end. <gasps> who's that? Oh, is that the guy who's been lighting the fires? It is, isn't it? The one who's been calling him from the telephone box. Oh my god, he killed him. Well, that was a pretty gruesome 30 seconds, wasn't it? He smacked her over the head. And then... He came in and killed the doctor. I wonder if she's dead or if she's just hurt. I mean, he's taken her off somewhere now. Flipping hell. That escalated very quickly, didn't it? Jeez. Um, okay. That um, changes things a little bit, doesn't it? Oh, here we go. A different kind of war. Maybe we've got to get her back now. Oh, we're playing as Jack now. It's a Jack case again, is it? The arsonist's a bug sprayer. He must have worked at one of these joints. Hmm. Okay. Um, nuclear bug and rodent control. Oh God! Look at all these things. Um, let's just go to rapid exterminators then, I guess. Just go to the first one on the list. It's probably the best way to do it, isn't it? No sirens. Sad times, guys. No sirens. Okay, we'll have to drive over there. And hopefully we don't crash into anybody. Which is unlikely. <laughs> we'll try our best, though. That's the main thing. All you can do in life is try, guys. Remember that. Remember that in future. All you can do is try. If you try and fail, then at least you've tried. And I'm trying not to smash into people on this game in, in a car. And I've failed. Hey. <laughs> oh, sometimes my timing is just impeccable, isn't it? You couldn't write it. You honestly couldn't write it, even if you tried to. Right, Rapid Exterminators, 2.43pm. Flipping hell. Okay, um... I think we will leave it there and then get into this in the next episode because we're pretty much out of time. So we'll call it an episode for there. Looks like another Kelso case. Um, things have escalated again. We're going to have to potentially do this quite quickly. Otherwise, maybe that guy's going to hurt Elsa or something, which we don't want. So, as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.